Hello YouTube, this is my emergency communications box. Without going into a whole diatribe about politics and the state of the world, my opinion is that it's probably good to have some form of communications that don't rely on the cell networks or the electrical grid. And in my case, this is it. What you're looking at is a Yesu FT6000 dual band VHF UHF radio mounted inside of a Pelican Storm case model. I am 2100. I myself am not 2100. I'm much younger than that. Um, this is a BioNO lithium iron phosphate battery, 12 amp hours. And there is a power cord connecting them that has Anderson power poles on one side and a standard T connector on the other side. This is connected to a Comet CH333 tri band antenna. It features VHF, UHF, and 1.25 meter. This box is pretty simple. The radio allows you to receive on FRS, which is the family radio service, GMRS, which is the general municipal radio service, I believe, MURS, MERS, which is the municipal urban radio service or something along those lines that spells MERS. Um, this radio will also pick up the Coast Guard Marine Band frequencies it will pick up the NOAA weather frequencies. It will pick up airplane traffic. Um, I have several airband frequencies programmed in here because we live under a flight path and I very frequently hear pilots talking to the control tower. Um, you can't transmit on those frequencies. It will pick up all ham radio frequencies in the two meter and 70 centimeter bands. I don't believe it picks up 1.25 meter. I'd have to check. Let's see. Um, apparently it does have receive capability on the 1.25 meter band, which is cool. I did not know that. It scans very fast. As a loudspeaker. The level is just slightly lower than your first uh, try there with the other mode. With this battery, I can operate this radio for about a week, you know, doing minimal talking, transmitting. I plan to get a Genesun solar charge controller because they have a very low radio frequency interference. And then you will be able to charge this panel while you're operating the radio from a solar panel, um, basically giving you unlimited operating time. I don't have any fantasies about, you know, what I'm gonna be doing with this other than trying to communicate with the local neighborhood. I have another box that I built last year that also has a CB radio built into it. But after listening to the CB bands, I have a feeling that's going to be limited utility in any sort of crisis situation. But it's good to have for monitoring purposes. Um, if you have any questions, put them in the comments. Not really a whole lot more to say about this. It's 50 watts. You can talk 30 miles in every direction. And if there's repeaters, you can talk even further. Um, I encourage you to figure out some sort of communication solution that works for you and your family and your neighborhood. Good luck.